Hi, I'm Janan, a Master Gardener with Sacramento County. In this presentation, I'll discuss a few insect and mite pests, which may sometimes be seen on your grapes. Grape leafhoppers, vinegar flies, and erinium mites are frequent visitors to grapevines grown around Sacramento. We are also on the lookout for vine mealybugs and brown marmorated stink bugs. Pale speckles on the leaves usually mean the grape leafhopper, a sucking insect, has been at work. Its young feed on the underside of grape leaves. The actual size of the adult is only an eighth of an inch. The nymphs are barely visible and they move quickly if disturbed. On the leaf's underside, you may also see tiny dried white skins from leafhopper molts as well as brown specks. The vinegar fly, or common fruit fly, lays eggs in split grape berries from which tiny maggots hatch to feed on the fruit. This allows bacteria and yeast to enter and cause bunch rots. Killing the adult flies does not control the problem. Because uncontrolled powdery mildew causes berries to split, good control of powdery mildew may help. Every year, home grape growers have questions about grape leaves with green warty bumps. The undersides of the bumps may be white, pinkish, or brown. These bumps, caused by erinium mites, are a cosmetic defect only, with no impact to the vigor of your vine or the tastiness of your grapes. Vine mealybugs with their cottony egg sacs, sticky honeydew, and sucking damage to clusters, shoots, and leaves can be a significant grapevine pest. They move down the trunk to hide in bark crevices or root areas during the winter. Here are some close-ups. Insects, white egg sacs, and honeydew glistening on grape berries. The female mealybugs are oval, slightly flat, and only one-eighth inch long. The winged males are much smaller, barely one-sixteenth inch. If you see the mealybug on grapes, collect some larger females in a jar of alcohol or sealed plastic bag to go to the local county agriculture commissioner. Stink bugs are seen commonly in gardens. Most can just be picked off. One type in particular is a bad actor, the brown marmorated stink bug. This insect can cause major garden and crop damage and can even invade homes in the winter. Look for white bands on the antennae, banded legs, smooth shoulders, and a striped rim around the abdomen sticking out a bit from under the wings. Now you're better prepared to inspect your grapevines for pests. Monitoring and early control will lead to healthier vines and a bountiful harvest.